Death home at last. Not a single bullet wound in sight. I feel like I'm forgetting something, though. Um, oh, that's right. I was supposed to go see Lucifer. Yeah, shit. I guess I'm gonna go do that then. <sighs> Going to go see Lucifer. Hey, excuse me, sir. Spare some change. Ew, you're poor. Yeah, that's the entire fucking point of me being out here. Uh, sorry, I don't carry money on me, but I do in my, um, one of my many pocket dimensions, but, um, I'm not giving money to you because you're a fucking imp and you have no rights. Goodbye. Uh, what a fucking asshole. That was my only chance of survival. <sighs> I guess I'm gonna resort to eating more dead alligator meat I found in the sewers. It sounds fun. On my second On my day second of being day in hell, Lucifer gave to me absolutely fucking nothing. Where is Lucifer anyways? Oh! Lucifer? Lucifer, was that you? If you tried to fight me, I'll fucking kill you! I'll break your neck in seven different ways! Oh, Grim, you won't do horse shit. Ugh, I'd like to see you try to break my neck, Grim. It's basically non-existent. You see, your neck, on the other hand, it's massive, and I could probably just grab it and snap it with three fingers. Ugh, yeah. Okay, Lucifer, why did you want to see me? Well, Grim, as king of hell and king of sin, um, it's my, uh, job and responsibility to look over you and make sure you don't get yourself into any trouble. And while I was looking over you, I noticed that, like, 30 years ago, you had sex with this woman named Scarlet. And, um, you guys... Well, you, you did get married, somehow. I'm not sure how the fuck that happened after you guys clearly broke up. But, um, you never got divorced, so logically, since this is hell, she gets custody over your kids, Grim. So, you gotta hand him over. <laughs> uh, Lucifer? I'm not handing over my fucking kids to some ratish swine. Aw, boo fucking who? That sucks to be you. Oh, shit, those are bars. Anyways, Grim, if you don't hand over your kids, you will be terminated. Psh, hurt, hurt, hurt. <laughs> terminated? Fucking how? What are you gonna do? Throw me into a black hole? I've survived worse. Oh, let me guess, you're gonna build a time machine and let me survive the Big Bang? I've survived the Big Bang 20 fucking times. Lucifer, if you want to terminate me, you're gonna need some sort of fucking angelic or proto-charged weapon. And you, Lucifer, you can't acquire those. God fucking hates you. Well, Grim, let's just say I have a little something. Calm down, Big Daddy. <sighs> I have to go. I have to go. I down. I have to go. I down. No. I have to go. I down. Hello, 
Lucifer, what do you want? No, no, you do not have my kids. Trust me, you don't have my kids. I would be able to smell you into my palace. Look, Lucifer, listen, if you had my kids, you would not be living, okay? So, why did you call me? You know what? I'm gonna go check. I'm gonna go check on Ori. You only have Ori? Okay, so Nori's here. Okay, so I'm gonna go see if Ori's here, and if she isn't, I'm going to rip off your legs and shove them down your throat. Understood? Great. Good talk. Bye. Hmm. So it appears Lucifer wants to die today. I can make that happen. Alright, princess. Your father clearly doesn't care about you. Keywords, he's not here. Bye-bye, lady. Come on, Lucifer. You have to give him some time. Yeah, shit. I suppose you're right. I'll give him a uh, fucking ten seconds. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. <laughs> you know, Dad, you're okay sometimes. No. Lucifer. <sighs> Grim, I'm simply just trying to do my job, and you, a pathetic, rich, pompous Goetia, has to come running in here, yelling profanities in my face, while I am meaningly trying to just give the person that deserves custody over your kids the correct custody that they deserve. Okay, Grim, I'm trying to do my job. I don't want to get exiled. I don't want to get sent up to heaven and reincarnated as a fucking spider. Okay, Grim, I'm trying to do my job, and if you got a problem with that, Fight me, bitch. How dare you? If you think you, a pathetic, disgusting prince of sin, well, no, you're the king of sin, but you, Lucifer, you, you're not even the king of hell. You're the, I guess, heir to the throne. You're heir to the throne, a stepson, not really a stepson. You're basically the devil's little brother. Lucifer, you, you do not get to talk over me. I can easily destroy you in a fist fight, Lucifer. I'm pretty sure Satan, one ring down, can probably fuck you up. No, 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 six rings down, Belphegor. He would rip you to shreds. Yeah, Belphegor. Lucifer, if you think you get to talk over me, you are dead fucking wrong. Wow, your voice got louder and there was a magical fucking echo. I'm so damn scared right now. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Lucifer, one last question. Who gets custody over my kids? You, you, just please fucking let me go, fuck. Good choice. Now I will be going. Hopefully, I don't see you again this season. And if I see you again for the remainder of season one, I will truly rip off your legs and shove them down your throat. Goodbye, Lucifer. <laughs> Thank you.
<sighs> As per usual, Grim is up to no good. What do you guys think I should do? I got a great idea. I'll pay you 50 bucks.